video demonstrates how to change the layout, the margins and orientation and the number of columns of your Scientific Word or Scientific Workplace PDF document. So file, new document, I'm going to start with articles, AIP, and when we click on PDF preview, this is an ordinary portrait document. Zoom out to see the margins. Margins fairly generous. Let's close that and change to landscape. So typeset, document format, and on the general tab, we go down to basic layout and change page orientation from portrait to landscape. Now at the moment we haven't had to enable overriding the document style. If we wanted any of these grayed out options, we'd have to select overriding the document style. Now all we've done so far is change to landscape paper. We haven't changed the margins accordingly. That's why we still have the width of the text as if it's a portrait document and these silly large margins. Let's go back into the document, typeset, document format, and change the margins accordingly. So on the page layout tab, we'll need to enable overriding the page layout, landscape, A4 paper. It tells us that the page height is 6.27, and the page width 11.69. So with an inch margin all the way around, approximately, we're looking for page uh, text height to be about 6.27. So text height, let's reduce to 6.3. And the page width, the text width, needs to be about 9.6, 9.7. Now we can adjust it by eye till we're happy with how it looks on the page. Or indeed we can cheat a little bit by selecting center vertically and center horizontally. And then maybe adjusting the width and height again. Select OK. And PDF preview. This is looking much more like it. A landscape document with margins that are much more sensible. Let's do a couple more things. Let's close the PDF preview, go back into typeset document format. Suppose we wanted a title page here, we'd need to enable overriding the document style and then select title page. Now PDF preview. I'm actually using Command Shift P on a Mac or Control Shift P on Windows. Title on its, on its own page, table of contents on its next page, and then the text starts. Let's finally go back in and decide we want to have two columns. So typeset document format. We're already overriding the document style, select columns, change from one to two, and click on OK. PDF preview. And there is our landscape document, title page, and then into two columns, table of contents, and the rest of the text of our document. So hope that was helpful. That shows how to change the layout of your page and adjust the margins and also change the orientation of the document.